Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Let's get started. In this video you will see in which direction the price of Bitcoin has moved recently. Additionally, you will find out what the technical indicators SMA, Divergence, Stochastic RSI and MACD are predicting about its price and future movements. If you are not familiar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos down below in the description. Looking at the Bitcoin hourly time frame, the price moved only slightly to the downside with around 0.6% in the last 24 hours, with a current price of 35,996. Looking at the hourly simple moving averages, at the moment, the price is between the 20 and the 50 SMA. If the price bounces off the 20 SMA which is currently at 35,758 it could be seen as a support and the 50 SMA that is at 36,736 could be perceived as a resistance to the upside. If there were to be a break either way, it means that there could be a continuous move in that direction. Searching for divergence in the hourly time frame, there was a bullish divergence, but the price went to the downside, which was actually not expected. Moving to the hourly stochastic RSI, both the percent %K and percent %D lines are located in the higher region. This means that the price is high due to overbuying and a change in the trend, or at least some kind of consolidation, can be expected. The K line is currently located below the D line, meaning that there is a downwards trend. Moving to the hourly MACD, the MACD line is above the signal line, which shows that the current trend is on the upside. But according to the MACD histogram, we can see that the momentum is going down. Owing to this we can expect the price to remain stable and you should wait and see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be a downward trend. Moving to the three hourly simple moving averages, for this time interval, the current price is below all of the simple moving averages, which looks bearish and you should keep an eye on the closest SMA. The 100 SMA will play as resistance or the price will peak above the current price which is around 36,962. It's important to note that currently the price is below the 200 SMA, which is normally a strong resistance. A potential move upwards, however, could be signaled if it were to break decisively upwards. Looking at the 3 hourly stochastic RSI, the stochastic RSI currently shows no overbought or oversold conditions but the percent %K line is over the percent %D line, which means the current trend is to the upside. Moving to the 3 hourly MACD, the MACD line is below the signal line, which shows that the current trend is on the downside. But it's expected for the price to remain the same for some time because the MACD histogram shows that the momentum at the moment is shifting upwards. You should wait and see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be bullish. Moving to the daily simple moving averages, for this time interval, the current price is below all of the simple moving averages, which looks bearish and you should keep an eye on the closest SMA, the 20 SMA will play as resistance or the price will peak above the current price which is around 37,017. Moving to the daily stochastic RSI, the stochastic RSI currently shows no overbought or oversold conditions, but we can see that the trend is currently going down because the K line is below the D line. Moving to the daily MACD, seeing as the MACD line is above the signal line, meaning that the trend is currently on the up. However, the MACD histogram shows that the momentum is currently shifting to the downside and it could be expected that the price will consolidate and it is better to wait and see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be bearish. In general, the larger time frames have a greater impact on the price, so please remember that when we display different time frames with different indicators. And also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short term trading. Thanks for watching and know that every few hours new videos are uploaded analyzing different cryptocurrencies, so be sure to hit subscribe and not miss out. If you have any questions, leave a comment below and we'll get back to you ASAP. Also, keep in mind that you should make your own investment decisions as cryptocurrency trading is very risky and these daily videos are only an overview of trends and are a purely technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. See you next time. Next time.